Hi, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. And today I want to give you guys my number one secret to success. Yes, I want to give you guys my secret that can help you change your life. Now we're entering a new year and a lot of people out there are feeling worried and stressed out from all the things that have been going on. So I thought today was a perfect time to give you guys a video on what you guys should be doing or remembering to do. So watch this quick video all the way to the end. And don't forget, if you're new to my world of metaphysics, this is the Law of Attraction Metaphysical Life Coaching Channel that brings you information in an easy to understand manner. So listen, don't forget to like, subscribe, and tap that bell. Now let's get started. I'm back. Now, what is it that I have to tell you about my number one secret for success for 2021? Yes, something that can actually change your life. We have been told this great secret over and over again, but we always convert back to our old way of living, our old way of thinking, our old way of behaving. Listen, I've been there. It happens. Don't worry about that. The thing is to recognize and correct and then move on. We have to understand what we see in our lives, we create it. Now, I get a lot of slack over this, a lot from people when they write comments to me, but I'm going to continue saying this. And for those that actually listen and for those that actually believe, toot toot to you. I'm happy for you. And I'm sure you're going to start seeing changes in your life. We are governed by universal laws. You have to think about it. You have the birds, you have the trees, you have the insects, you have the grass. All of these things live on year after year with or without our help. Why is this so with other creatures and not with human beings? Believe me, God did not place us here to struggle, to have a hard life. If we are having these things come up in our lives, it's because of man not because of God. Now, my biggest secret for me, and I'm telling you to help change your life for 2021 is to control your thoughts. Listen, we all get off track sometime. Don't get me wrong, but it's to control your thoughts. Whatever you are thinking, whatever you are believing, whatever you are doing in your life, is actually creating your future. When you go out there and you go to work and you're having constant problems at work, sit back and say to yourself, hey, look, I got to get out of this situation. But at the same time, I need to realize how I got into it. What inside of me attracted this situation? You have to watch what it is you are sending out there. You have to watch what are you thinking, which leads to what are you believing in your life that is actually creating your future. People say, well, Yvette, I didn't cause those people to be nasty towards me at work. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Inside of you, deep down, you had a belief about yourself or a belief about your job that kept bringing these things to you. Now, have you ever got out of bed in the morning and just did not want to go to work or get up? And then all of a sudden you spilt your coffee in the morning. Then your car wouldn't start. Then somebody tried to run you off the road by accident. Then you got to work. You got there late and your boss was waiting there for you because there was a big meeting that you forgot about it. These are sequences that happens in your life because you created it. You started off by not wanting to get out of bed that morning and it just boomeranged and it just went on and on and on just like dominoes. You create your life. Now, we're just talking about something that just happened in the morning. Now, let's talk about things that you think of all the time. Oh my God, my husband, he's such a pain in the neck. Oh my God. And you know what? That relationship is not going to go anywhere because you keep thinking that husband is a pain in the neck. Whatever it is you are throwing out there, 
especially if you're focusing on it multiple times, constantly. We all been there now. Don't get me wrong. I've been there. There's been times I'm like, oh my God, this job. Oh my God, it's time to move on. Voila. Then all of a sudden something happens. You're sitting there. Everybody's getting into an accident. Everybody's on the road going crazy. Then they're just driving reckless and they're getting in an accident. All of a sudden you get an accident. Believe me, that happened to me a couple of years ago. Whatever it is you are focusing on, whatever it is you constantly speak about, you are bringing that into your life. God did not place us here to struggle. God gave us a beautiful gift to create the life that we desire. And it all starts with our thoughts and our thoughts create our beliefs. And once you create your belief, you create feelings behind these thoughts and beliefs. And the feelings is what propel whatever it is you're thinking into the future. By watching what you think and what you say, you can actually change your life in 30 days. Now, again, this is very easy, but at the same time, it's very difficult because we have been so conditioned into the way we handle ourselves day in and day out. We watch movies. We get up. We look at the news. We're like, oh my God, did you hear that person got raped? Oh my God, did you hear that person? What he did? Listen, it's okay to know what's going on in the world, but I tell people, do not focus on it. Find something to do to take your mind off of it. Get out there and always try to do something every day that you love to do. I love to read. I love animals. So I feed the birds five days a week now. I go out in the morning. I start my morning off by feeding the birds. I want to start my morning off happy. God did not say, oh, you focusing on that. That is not the right thing to do. No, God is saying, this is what you want in your life because this is what you're focusing on. If you're focusing on paying bills, you will continue to accumulate bills. Okay? If you're focusing on money and you have deep down inside of you that money is evil and the people that have the money, they cheated to get the money. So you're associating money with negativity. People have to understand these things happen and you have to learn to recognize it, change it, and move on. What is my biggest secret for 2021 to help change my life that can also help change yours? And that is, again, you are what you think about. You are what you believe and you will continue to be until you change your thoughts and you change how you feel about certain situations. Some people have the best of luck with attracting money, but the worst in relationships. You might have people that are very smart and very good and at the same time can't keep a job. If you see these things in people's lives, you have to stop and say, what is going on inside of them? What is going on in their mind? What are they thinking? And then once you realize that you create your life, you can easily see in someone's life where their thinking is going wrong. People can see in my life where my thinking is going wrong. Okay? Each and every one of us have the power to create the life that we want. It takes 30 days to reprogram your subconscious mind. Only thing you need to do is change any negative thinking, any negative belief that you have and change it into something positive. Like if you're saying your husband is a pain in the neck, start focusing on all the good things your husband does. Start focusing on the good things your job provide, like the money to pay your rent, the money to send your kids to school, the money to put food on your table. Start focusing more on the positive instead of the negative. So that you can convince your subconscious mind that you want more of what you're focusing on. Again, it all starts with a thought and that thought turns into a belief. Listen to what you're saying in your head. At the same time, follow those feelings. If you have feelings on anything you're talking about, anything you're thinking, and it brings up negative feelings inside of you, change it. 
If you're talking about your job and you're not happy with it, you're going to build up negative feelings. Those feelings are vibrations and it's going out. So you have to learn. Take those feelings. Switch it around. Talk about the things that you do like about your job. And it has to be because you wouldn't be working there. If it wasn't giving you a salary, you wouldn't be working there. Okay? Speak about the nice people you did meet there instead of the bad ones. There's always positive in something negative. Sometimes people take the worst things that have happened to them in their life and build it into an enterprise. People have taken things and wrote books, started companies, safety, anything. They turned something negative into something positive. How do you think we came up with the seatbelt? All of these things came up because somebody took something negative and created something and built it into something positive. Listen, people, my greatest secret to you for 2021 is to watch your thoughts. Whatever it is you think of, whatever it is you believe is creating your life. Again, you are what you think, okay? But let me tell you, it's not permanent. You are what you think can change at any moment. So it's up to you to make that decision to correct your life, to change your life, and get it in the direction that you want your life to go into. If you're happy with whatever you're doing, congratulations. If there's a part of your life that you're not happy with, sit back, think about why is this so, and make changes. We have to start taking full responsibility for our lives in order for our lives to change. I love you guys. And I just want the best for you for the new year. Again, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. I'm always giving you law of attraction, metaphysical knowledge to help change your life. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and tap that bell. You can follow me at myworldofmetaphysics.com where you can get one-on-one -on -one coaching from me. You can also go to store.com myworldofmetaphysics.com where you can buy crystals, sage, oils, candles, whatever it is that you desire on a metaphysical level. Again, this is Yvette. Namaste.